Okay, we've got to work out AB. That's the distance from there to there. Now, looking at this triangle, we see these two arrows, which means BE and CD are parallel, and that's very important. It means that the triangle ABE, the small one, and the triangle ACD, the big one, are similar. In other words, the proportions of ABE and ACD are the same, which means this is a ratios question. And that's what we're going to use to solve it. So, to find AB, we're going to use the fact that the ratio of AB to BE is the same as the ratio of AC to CD, because the two triangles are similar. So let's put that in an equation. The ratio of AB to BE, in other words, AB divided by BE, is the same as AC to CD. Okay? So, therefore, AB divided by BE is 6, is AC is 11.7, and CD is 13.5. Okay, multiply both sides by 6, and you get AB is 6 times 11.7 over 13.5. Stick that in the calculator, and it turns out to be 5.2 centimetres, I think. Yes, that's right. Okay, there you go. 5.2 centimetres. Good. Now we have to work out ED from there to there. Same thing. We're going to work out AD and then just subtract 4 from it to get ED. So we know that the ratio of AD to CD, so using big triangle dimensions, CD, is the same as, same as AE to BE using a little triangle dimensions. Okay, therefore AD over 13.5 is AE 4 over BE which is 6. Therefore AD is 13.5 times 4 over 6 and it turns out that AD is 5 centimetres. Uh, sorry, AD is 9 centimetres. I'm getting ahead of myself. I do apologise. The whole thing is 9 centimetres. Okay? Yeah, AD is 9 centimetres. Because, um, yeah, that's right. And now we just subtract the 4 to get ED. So, therefore, if the whole thing is 9, then E to D must be 9 minus that bit, which is 4. So, ED is 9 minus 4, which is 5 centimetres. I must remain focused. There you go. Pretty nice, straightforward ratios question.